FTP pass to Matt lets you transform a position pass uh, rendering, which looks like this, uh, into a 3D mask. So basically on this footage, every value for a pixel it's, is positioned in a 3D space. So with FTP pass, I can just select the color. So I'm going to switch it to linear. Maybe turn it on and display the position pass. And let's say I want to select this lamp in the background. I click on it, then go back to the final. And now I need to tweak my, uh, let's see, mask until I get, there we go. Let me change that a little bit. Uh, reduce the fall off uh, like that, make it more oh, and let's see if I can just tweak. There we go. And so now, even if the camera is going to move, this is a 3D mask, so the lamp will always be selected. And now, back in it, I can apply some contrast to it. I'll change just the value of the lamp itself. I could do the same thing on her. So I could go back, I'm gonna reset it, set it to linear, position pass, I'm gonna well, maybe select it when she's right there, select the head, Switch back to final output, and now I have a mask around her, so I can just make it so it goes around her head. I can press command to be a bit more precise. There we go. Uh, push the onness a little bit, fold off, reduce it, and maybe change those. Oopsie. Yep. Um, push this one, but not too much. Okay. Just a Y. There we go. Have a basic mask around her, which I could make more. Mm, there we go. More precise. Uh, maybe change that a little bit just to make it on top of our head, tweak the boy to, oopsie, not this one, the Z, here we go. So I have basically our head selected, and then I can just apply the modification right on our head, and it will follow our face. Here we go, FTP pass.